Absolutely what you see on TV happening in California has happened in Austin, will happen again in Austin, and I'm really hoping that my community will prepare in advance. Jester Estates, which backs up to the Balcones Canyonland Preserve, had heeding the warning the neighboring Steiner Ranch wildfire left six years ago. Tonight, KXAN's Kylie McGivern shows us a 3D wildlife simulator designed to show communities just how quickly a wildfire can spread. If a wildfire starts in the canyon, the entire neighborhood is at risk. Jeff Shapiro chairs Jester Estates Firewise Committee, and in the years right since the historical the Steiner Ranch fire, has sounded the alarm to warn neighbors of the dangers. I watched that fire, and the videos that were coming out of that looked just like my street. Another neighborhood with one way in and one way out. That's when it became real. That's when it became very real. Next to a real fire, this. We're at one hour. 15 minutes in is the best way so Shapiro knows how to get people's attention. It's called a sim table and allows you to mimic the topography of a certain area and see how quickly a fire would spread in real time under different conditions. We want people to understand that it's not a big wall of fire that you have to worry about. It's the ember storm that leads the fire. And if you keep uh, your property clean and your bushes trimmed and keep things out of your gutter that are combustible, you have a much better chance of surviving that ember storm and not lighting the house on fire. At the demonstration, Ron Hertzfeld and his wife looked on, knowing the deeper meaning. By the time the summer comes, we're going to have a lot of fuel, and uh, that's, that's a real concern. Knowing they each need to do their part, with Steiner Ranch seared in their memory. It was a wake up. You know, to, to see that we just need to just be prepared and go about what we need to do to protect ourselves and our property. If you're not prepared in advance, then it's too late. Kylie McGivern, KXAN News. Shapiro says he would like to see wildfire prevention incorporated into Code Next, including an overlay map identifying areas with the highest risk and recognizing certain neighborhoods should not be designed with one way in and one way out. In July, we told you people in Jester Estates were worried that speed cushions would slow them down if they needed to get out quickly in case of a wildfire evacuation. Well, in August, the Austin Transportation Department put the program on hold after these complaints, it also announced several changes to the program, like better notification to neighbors about speed cushions and taking people with special needs into consideration.